Hello, everybody. Welcome to another episode of the Lyrical Laughter Podcast. My name is Caleb. This is Andrew, and we're (laughs) (laughs) going to try. Because it's fucking, I'm tired, man. I got three hours of sleep last night. Stressed out at work. Working with big old Jerry's. Where'd that go, bro? Did you put it in my shoe? Who? Tripod's wearing shoes. (laughs) <laughs> Deck those shoes are a fucking hit, bro. When's the, when's the last time you got a new pair of shoes? About a year ago. About a year ago. We actually ago. at the beginning of this year, so better hit the Skechers outlet. Skechers? Oh, big time. <laughs> Wait, really? Big, big time Skechers, man. <laughs> are you serious, bro? <laughs> Two for a hundred. <laughs> Really? Oh, dude! <laughs> <laughs> you think I'm fucking playing with you, dog? Already hot, dude. Oh, dude, Skechers is the shit, man. Slip on shit. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck are you laughing at, man? You making fun of me because I don't buy like no, at knees and fucking supers anymore? <laughs> I thought you slip on shit. I thought you. I love slip ons, dude. I love slipping on shit. Hell no. No, that's that's because I always wear Vans, but. The, <laughs> I don't need to really wear work boots at work. Dude, get Skechers. Go with me. I was going to get new balances and turn into a dad. That too. I'm going to sit up straight. Yep. Better posture, better life, or whatever. Bing bong, you know. Mm, Taco Bell was good. Um, Hell, yes. Job. I bought, that's the third time I've gotten that pair of shoes. I like them so much. I'm happy for you. Nicole and I did this thing the other day where I do it every time. Even with my parents, I'm like trying to guess what they got me for Christmas because I think I'm some kind of like profiler or something. Sure. So <laughs> I'm like, pretty good at guessing though. I thought so, but I had her. I'm good at manipulating. <laughs> mm, let's see where this goes. Uh, because I pretend that I already know the answer, and then she gets bummed out. And she's like, "All right, fine." And by her reactions, I can tell what was right and what was wrong about my questions. So I, but I was so convinced. I was like, "Like this is for an example." I asked her what she got me. I was convinced it was a pair of Vans, a new shoes, and I was like. She was like, said something about the color, and I was like, well, it's black. And she was like, and she checked, and she was like, yeah. And I was like, because we agreed to, to only get each other one thing this year. Hmm. So we just saved money, and then I wanted to focus on my family a little bit more, because we can do something after Christmas anyway. Right. Last minute. <clears throat> so we got each other one thing. And I was like, I thought you said one thing. She was like, I did get you one thing. I was like, there's two of them in there. Or multiple in there. And she was like, how did you know? And I was like, oh, so there is multiple things in, in like, one thing. I was like, they come multiple things in the box because I already convinced her that I already knew. Oh, right. You start guessing shit. Yeah, I was like, I need the other ones in the box for it to work with the one thing. So you got me more than one thing. And she was like, oh, how'd you know? And that's how I found out there's more than one thing. Two black things. You're thinking shoes. Yeah, I was convinced with shoes, and I was, like, saying how I'm going to be able to use it. And, uh, yeah, it wasn't shoes. It was a, it was a manscaped. But I had her convinced. She was all upset because I guessed. You already sh- opened it? No. But I got her to tell me because I was like, I already know what it is. She's like, all right. I don't. The ones to, so you didn't open it? But you know what it is. Yeah. I don't understand. Because it's being delivered still. Oh. I was she like, was so bummed out because she thought I already knew, like but I box, didn't like. know. I was just guessing. <laughs> Shoes for 500. Questions. We were playing 20 <laughs> questions. Oh. So she was like, oh, whatever. And I was like pretending that I already knew. She guessed what I got her like really quick, but I gave her too big of a clue. What did you get? I got her that Scarlet interface so she can use that mic. Two I two like this one, nice. Yeah, yeah. Ju- just like yours. I have the f- second gen or something, but this is the third gen, so probably what you got. I don't think they make the second. Oh, I've this a- is like the current two I two. Yeah, I got. I have an older version. You do the two, maybe it's not the two I two. Just a straight up solo. 
Or do we have the same? No, yours. You have Mine's a different a, I face. Think it's a solo. Oh. I don't fucking know. Podcasts. They have different gens. I don't know. Yes, I'm at um, interface. Those are goofy. What a dumb piece of equipment. You and Hannah already gave each other. Did you get give her yours? Yeah, it was just a bunch of shit for the house. So no Curtains. presents under the Christmas tree for me. <laughs> Mom, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Wait, so but, that's what I meant to ask. She didn't give you yours. No. Oh. So you gotta sit there, and she has a camera. She's like, Let me open one, and she's like, "No." I'm just blinding myself. <laughs> yeah, she's like smoking a cigarette. Like, hold it up, show us what you got. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny if your walls were that color or made of wood like that. That's what your living room would look like, kind of. <laughs> Oh, okay. You had a window. That I thought you were just like, if your house looked like that, it would it would kind of look like this. <laughs> yeah, it would a little bit. I see, though. Yeah, yeah. My sister's coming from North Carolina tomorrow, I think. It's tomorrow, Wednesday? Yeah. Yes. Hey, day. Oh, we just exposed when we record these. Don't. Yeah, let's get, I get early pay. Tuesday. This is my banking. Oh. Uh, no. she's coming from North Carolina. I took her old bedroom. I've when we first moved into that house. Does she know this? Yeah. Yeah. But when I first moved in the house, uh, I wanted that bedroom so like really badly. It was bigger too, and I didn't end up getting getting it obviously. And I uh, finally got it. And now she has to sleep on the couch when she visits. It is a lot larger of a bedroom than I had realized. Yeah, and then it doesn't seem so large when I put all my shit in there. Like, all of my shit <laughs> from yeah, multiple right. rooms into one room. But You got something there? I'm trying, but, you know, I can't read. <laughs> <laughs> Classic, you know, who done it? All kind of read. Wow. Yeah, like a, a day in the life of, you know. What of could you? that be like? Eh, anyone. And pick someone. What are we gonna phone him up? I'll oh, give you Gary. You know, like, what do you think? Here's a day in the life of Gary. Hmm. Ready? Hmm. Behind you, behind you. Mom, what's for dinner? Behind you, behind mom, you. Mom, mom, bathroom, <laughs> bathroom. <laughs> 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 like South Park, mom bring you his shit bucket. Oh boy. He's. Just kidding, Gary. He's not watching this anymore. Yeah, you don't watch these anymore, Jabarbi. Gerb. Gerb. Why does he live so far away? We could be doing this together. He could be sitting right here or right here. So, Taco Bell lunch money? You could just be... If you just prepay for all these gift cards, you could save money in the long run. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what... With Taco Bell... And the uh, lady, this is the second time I've gotten her in the drive-thru, 7 p.m., and she's like, I hand her a gift card that I got, and she was like, oh, lunch money. And I was like, uh, yeah. And she was like, if people if people should do this more often. And I was like, do what? And she's like, save money for food on the side. Put money away for food on the side. It will save you money. And I was like, yep. I didn't even want to, like engage it with conversation i don't know what that any of that meant lady but you know keep taking your adderall and (laughs) giving me time dude the food was out and i literally pulled up and her hand was out the window already with both i was like how'd you make six taco no yeah six items and then uh, yeah i don't understand eight items actually with cinnamon twist and then individually five that was like the best taco bell experience i've ever had the one time i haven't had taco bell in so long you were like Dude, you should order Taco Bell. Let's do it through the mobile app. And I was like, sweet. Oh, you did? Yeah. No, not just now, but remember a couple months ago, I haven't had Taco Bell in a long time before that. It was when I lived in Oxford. And we were going to go, we were going to play games or something. And I was like, I'll be right back. I'm going to go get food first or you just talk to the school. <laughs> Dude, I ordered it, drove there, and sat in the lobby for over an hour. They forgot our, or- they forgot multiple people multiple people's orders. I've had that happen to me before but it was like 
one person in like it was it wasn't that long no dude they were serving everyone else in front of us forever it's like dude holy shit and then they put <clears throat> an acoustic girl at the counters so no one could get mad and yell at her so the manager's in the back you can't be mean to an acoustic girl <laughs> right <laughs> who was like 16 she ain't electric she's like i'm sorry he uh was working on the second page and your order was on the first page and we forgot it <laughs> i was like so are you working on it now it'll be out soon and she just wipes the same spot on the counter <laughs> just <laughs> she's spitting out she's an old bartender in the midwest midwest at least she talked like one plot twist we're about to do the cod tier list without gary Oh really? No, I'm just kidding. We want to do a different what tier list? What's a tier list we could do? What do we both porn fuck stars? Us? Oh yeah, mom. Right oh, now, I would just that. skip ahead like 20 minutes. It's gonna take us 20 minutes. 20 minutes. I don't know tier list thing. I'd be interested. How about? Hmm. What are some games we both play? You want to do games? We could do always do games, or we could do. Like, what do you go like we could do like fucking kill switch engage albums or something mm. do you go mm do you play me mmorpgs no so that's out of the question like categories all right now what, final fantasy 14 and like world of warfare like role playing just regular rpgs i play a lot of rpgs i don't play mmos mm. well you said world of warcraft what's that you play World of Warcraft? No. Oh. That is an MMO. I tried yeah. because it's so obviously hyped up, but I couldn't get into it. I but everyone's like after you get past level forty. I'm like, dude, it takes me I it was weird. I hate learning new games. So speaking of, there's this game I bought a long time ago that came out. It's called Scum. And it's a it's supposed to be this super realistic fucking survival game. You're a prisoner. It's scum. Yeah. You're a prisoner on an island with zombies and other players and fucking mechs. So, like, big-ass robots. And, uh... <clears throat> which is cool. But the survival is ridiculous. If you look it up and you can see your metabolism and your health, how much milliliters of water do you need in your stomach, your nutrients, your body fat, just like ridiculous. You have to shit and piss. You have to fucking, it's crazy. Isaac ended up playing with, so I bought it a long time ago because it was just came out and it was obviously need to be worked on a lot more, but they wanted some people to test the game out. So I got it. Now I, think I remember you guys playing that. Yeah, it was really buggy. So I just, I haven't played it for a while. And then I seen they recently did a huge update on it. So got back into it. It was way better. Now it's way more optimized, which is nice. So, Something to look I really because around this time of the year, I did you see your Steam replay? Mine, yeah. Did you sign into your account on the deck? Yeah, I didn't have anything, I didn't play anything all year. Uh, true, I sold my PC at the end of last year. I wonder if it, yeah, I was just wondering if it went back years it does like a replay and what games you played wallpaper wet. engine for 300 hours yeah <laughs> oh yeah because that count i i well that's not what nicole said it wasn't on there it i think it differentiates apps does it yeah but uh it was pretty cool they're uh right around this time i get really back into like survival games and then it's like it's like a hop it is this time of year isn't it yeah, because, dude, like, last time, shit, dude, I miss just being in school. Right now, I would be on, like, a two-week break for Christmas, and I would just be locked in my room playing some fucking game. And I hate snow and winter for how cold it is and just shitty, trying to wipe your and scrape your car off and everything else you have to deal with. But just looking at it's pretty nice while you're inside. It's cozy like that. Like this. I like that. Damn, dude. 
All right. All right. Hold but on. Yeah. I got something, though. I got something. We can do a little spin off version. One sec. Well, what's your favorite Call of Duty of all time? Black Ops 3 or 2. Probably. But that that's yeah. the thing. I. Because I've thought about this. Because if I went back and played it now, I probably it was the nostalgia is not the same. You know what I mean? Like when Black Ops Two just dropped, everyone's playing it. It's fucking different from everything else we've played before. Yeah, I mean. But if I go back and play it now, it's probably like shitty and. <gasps> what happened? Oh. Okay. <clears throat> let's 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 do this game's fucking maps. Oh. So you what about what that? about uh, what about aftermath? The one with the tore down building in the middle with the ambulances and shit. Ooh. This is all Black Ops Two. This is all Black Ops Two. Dude. No, I liked it sometimes. That would be decent. Well, let me <coughs> or look bad. at these other ones and compare. Well, we get there. We can remove later. Want to throw that in decent? No, uh, yeah. Or bad. It's a three lane. I don't like it. I don't it put may, it on bad. It makes me fucking mad. Cargo. What's cargo? Uh oh, dude. Yeah, this one had that like that crane that was lifting up and down all the time. Oh, I got that confused I with carrier. Say, yeah. I can't remember what cargo was. It's got like a round circle in the middle. Kind of three lane, but the center is super open. There's always like snipers going in like window, the window to the right, and it's like basically just. Shit. Oh yeah, it was a car because they put that map on. Um, I do like that map. They put it on Modern Warfare. Modern Warfare two one, two. No, this is a Black Ops map, so it never came yeah, to any of those. They put it on. They did they not put shit it on. Really? I know. They put it on. Uh, no, it was an oil rig. That's what I was thinking about. It was like a make, whatever. I don't think it was, but. It was. But, I so it's, I will say good. But Carrier, that was like, you're a sniper. Yeah, I like Carrier for sniping. Really? That would be good for me. Just good, though, because it's really open. Above Carrier? Cove can suck a nut sack. Yeah. Remember that? I remember playing with that with you Clove. when Cove came out. Oh, what's and the spawns were so fucking broken on the beach. Oh yeah, and then there's this like is, a, this includes DLC, so yeah, yeah. So there's like a uh little nest. I remember it. I would I would say never played personally. So if you didn't like it, let me put it bad. Oh yeah, you played. Oh, you yeah. played it. I played it with you. I thought. Yeah, I just don't remember it, so I, I would rather yeah, just true. chalk it up to I'll let you detour. What's that? Oh, it's also a um. DLC map. I think it was from the campaign. Like a highway that was all fucked I up. I can't remember that one. Leave it like Left 4 Dead. It was okay. Dig. I don't know Dig, do I? Oh, yeah, it was just all trenches. It, the whole map was just trenches. I didn't like it. Yeah, I'll just leave it there. Then. Downhill was from... Uh, I think that's also there's a lot of DLC here. I'm not I'm not even noticing. Grind was sick. The skate park. I just was geeked that it was the skate park. It was pretty cool. I'll put great. Yeah, that was a good map. Hell yeah. Um What about OG Yemen? What's that? Yemen. The OG. Where do you not see that? OG OG, but but uh, second or last, dude. This map is fucking weird. Wasn't that on the OG COD? No. This was the first. Yeah, that's a that's a BO2 original. Oh, great! I'll put it in great. That map played fucking weird. I liked it for because of that. Yeah, man. I, yeah, man. I I like when it breaks like away from tradition. You know. Yeah, you get a skate park and then a fucking third world. Oh, this was a classic. Plaza was sick. Excellent. Because I'd either have the best games on that map or the worst. Wait, wait. Can I just speak for all of us? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Rain yeah, is yeah, sick. Sure. Oh, this is so... 
it's Raiders God tier slums. Remember slums? Yeah, dude, that was kind of weird. Cause I would I liked that map a lot. Is that be, from that picture behind that is a balcony with like a big mansion? You could jump off, and the middle was you go. Straight, no, the middle was like a little water left. fountain with like yeah. a little statue. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you're right. Yeah. It was, was kind of just right. like the favela of its time. Yeah. Um. Oh. Or do you want to just throw this fucker? Because this happens every time. <laughs> I always like it, but I always I'll just put. I'll just put depends it. on what game mode. Put it at the front of good, because the I front always, of good. Um. You have to put, dude. Wait, what? Stand off. Stand off. Yeah. God tier, dude. That was my favorite. That's another one. Rage still beats it. Stand off was my favorite, just because of the trick shot. I have a lot of memories map. on this map. Yeah, that one too. But, uh, but I couldn't see Dick. I feel like everything was just sandy. Was, nobody ever went below either. It was just always right. From, it was like a crash plane. It was, plane, so, it was but great. It was like a, it Do you was think? Like a, yeah, I would. I would agree because it's like kind of like a nice take on a plane crash, but instead of being like. But how is that on the new? Didn't they don't they have that map on the new MW3? No map has come back except for on this list so far, except for Raid and Standoff and Nuketown. They showed Turbine though. No, Raid and Standoff and Nuketown have come back in Cold War, but none. none of no, these I so mean far. in MW3 they brought back because Turbine is basically a MW2 map, is it not? No, it's just. I'm getting that confused with the other planes. This is all Treyarch, so no. Yeah, but I th I thought they because we par I hmm I thought no. they remade some of these. The what is ones that have been remade then? and brought turbine is like two canyon sides with a plane in the middle. Yeah, kind of was... looks like Afghan, but it's not. Oh, that's what I'm thinking of is yeah. Afghan. It's always a pla crashed plane, plashed crane. Okay. Uh, hijacked is also like yeah it's up there. Excellent. It's almost like oh, hijack has been remade too for Cold War. Yeah, I put that in front of Plaza. What the I, fuck's magma? I don't remember, dude. Was it the map from Zombies? They made multiplayer. I don't know if that was ever a thing. Weird. Yeah, like some of these, I'm not really too sure. Studio was remade multiple times. Studio. Or. Rush yeah, isn't that back. a firing range, dude? Is it what? Isn't Studio firing range? They just remade it. Oh yeah, see, you got one. Hell yeah, you remember that? I put this down here because it's fucking trash. That paintball map. It was yeah. It was fucking dog shit, and it came back in Cold War. I remember still specifically you getting in that mad on that map. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> and it's funny you put it next to Cove. Yeah. So fucking bad. Um, oh, Express. That came back in Cold War too. I did like... I like the train one. That'd be... Uh, <clears throat> better than Yemen, but less than Grind. Yeah. I don't know. Express is like in between great and excellent for me. This, yeah? Well, this podcast, you're going to be seeing the back of her head. I'll put it at the back of excellent. I really like that map. I just cut out a little bit. I do like it too. I'm starting to, okay, studio, I can just say firing range, and that's like, I love firing range. What do you think? Yeah, I do too. That's Rats, that's, though. That's an excellent though, because it's not firing range. Yeah, I'll put it at the back end, though. Put it at the, uh, rest, <laughs> I'm, starting to... <laughs> I'm, starting to, I'm starting to not recognize an encore. Wait a minute. It's a theater. I don't remember it. I don't remember it either. Meltdown. Meltdown. All right, guys, that's our Black Ops 2 <laughs> Mass <laughs> tier list. The My favorite are... game. I don't remember. Oh, fucking. Drone. That's the outdoor map. I liked it. With for the little... Do you remember it? Yeah. Okay, I remember it. I'll just put good. That was good. It was a good map. I a blink forgot. Is that, that was the one with like the it was like the little in the middle of the woods. It was like a little tech base. 
you yeah. go inside and have like electrical doors and stuff. Yeah. And, yeah, I forgot about that. But I think same with else, Pod did as well. Pod. I don't. I'm starting to not recognize most of these anymore. Like the Hydro and Mirage Overflow. I remember Hydro. That was a good map. It was a two lane, and then there was water you could go into on the right. It was a dam that you'd have to jump down into if you wanted to go to the outskirts of the map, and then there was a bridge in the middle, and then the floodgate would open under the bridge. If you got caught under there, then it would kill you with the water because it was at a dam. I don't remember that. So that that was a d decent map. Mm -hmm. Trying to remember. Uplink just looks like high rise. Oh, Frost was good. I don't remember Frost. I think it had the ski lift that people would try to jump onto. Hmm. I'm trying to remember. Oh, Mirage is, uh, it looks like Boneyard from here. I don't know. What I can't remember Scrap any of these other know. ones. Oh, Overflow was that little, that town. It was like one of the, it's in COD Mobile. I've played it recently on my phone. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, dude. Remember Overflow? No. I bet you if I showed a video, uh, you a video you'd be like, mother. Probably with all of these. No, I've never played the other ones. Straight up. If they're DLC, I didn't buy DLC for BO2 very much. Mm. I mean, I did. Obviously, we, we noticed what Cove was in like Rush, but those were clearly bad. So, <laughs> I don't really remember. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. We can pass on this one. Yeah. All right. Well, that's that. Hmm. Cool. Dare we do? I like your fancy. Oh, it's a tear makers website. Yeah, dude. I thought it was like a fucking stepdad. <laughs> <laughs> like a what? <laughs> like a stepdad. I'll get. I'll show you something to cry about. I'll show you something to <laughs> you give you. Tear maker. <laughs> Damn. Oh, I've been watching too much Theo Vaughn. What's this? Here we do another. Yeah, I'm down for another. What? You can pick one too, but not Black Ops 4. I was just going to do OG Black Ops. Did you play that one much? Oh, yeah. Remember, I got an Xbox and I, be, I got became, really good at your Wii. Yeah, good at the Wii. There were hmm. so many DLCs though for this one. Uh, well, I remember I know these DLCs better than I do the uh, what's unplayable the, trash. Ever played? No opinion. Unplayable dress. One to four. I don't like those ratings very much. I like the OG one. Oh, can you change those? Oh, this, the cogwheel? Aha. Uh -huh. I'm not going to sit here and edit yeah, these. Yeah, I know, right? Sorry. All of them. I'll just redo. I'll just find a different one. There we go. Yeah. Cool, they're not fucking named. <laughs> so this one's called... Go back to the other one. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Fuck me, right? Okay. <laughs> You guys got to guess by a fucking 26 by 26 little PNG thumbnail. Yeah, you asked if I could record this, and it's... I could, but, you know, I don't want to. <laughs> you can zoom in. Yeah, I'd be like, whoa. Uh, you know what? Try. No, you can do the OG. Arsenal Roblox maps, bro. <laughs> Wait. Sit up straight, Dez. Dez? Don't you mean... Annoying orange geez. episodes rated from God tier to unwatchable trash. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see if this one's good. Uh, why are they not, like, named? I like King. I like... 
I never remember the fucking names. I just Dude, there who's not naming these? Who's who's being lazy? Did you hit a setting or something? No, but this has like the name in it. Okay. They have gunfight maps on here. Yeah, they also have Azure Cave like twice. I, that F. Go away. Especially the night one. Put that at the the worst fucking idea they've ever had. Oh, speedball? Dude. Any night map, just put down there. I don't know if you like any of them. I fucking don't. Wait, dude, speedball. Okay, that's a that's a very top best class. You you would carry me in gunfight on speedball. Dude, I love speedball. Mm. I need a speedball right Hackney now. Yard? Remember Hackney Yard? Yes, that was a. Uh, oh, that's where I got that fucking. Uh, oh no, that's the one I was raging on. It's Des, not D's. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, I hit a nasty trick shot out the top of that fucking <gasps> tower. Did you get on that tower? No, like at the base level of it. Oh. The top, tippy top of the building. Mm. I like that map. Arklov Peak pissed me off. But I wouldn't say F. I got my highest killed game on Arklov Peak. Really? Yeah. I don't like the map, though. Oh. I was it like, was know fun a, for uh, sniping, but... not justified. Um, any of these are fun with sniping. You, Hill can go to fucking F. I hate Hill more. Can, is there? Can we? Can we put a G, dude? Oh, I fucking hate. Where's Hill. Hill? Exactly. That's why I don't like the map because you can't fucking see anything on it. Oh, the gunfight map. Oh my god, I hate it. I'm gonna punch it. Uh, well, what about? <laughs> but, yeah. Remember Ramaza? You were pretty good at that on search. Yeah, I like Ramaza. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Ah. St. Petrograd was... Oh, you don't like that? There you go. I liked it. These were all... Cause I, no, I didn't mean to put it there. I like play that. Search, really. In Gunfight. Port of Verdansk. Oh, that's oh. a ground war map. Yeah, it was just the part of the fucking... The Port of Verdansk. I don't know how I... I don't remember it. Eh. This game just shit. <laughs> oh, Gunrunner. We liked that, didn't we? Yeah, that was a good one. That so. map is where my first TikTok clip, I was. I literally was just running around the map playing search. It was 1v1. Didn't know where the guy was, and the time was almost up, so I just shot a random wall and headshot him through the wall. Just, it looks like I'm hacking. You, you oh, got really? a fucking walker, dude. Dude, I will watch it. It's fucking dope. Wait, Ozzy or K, what about Dave? It does not just TikTok. What about regular Azir Cave? I liked it. It was all right. I'll put it in D. C because D. Yeah. I put on a thermal scope on an M4 and changed it to those ten round SOCOM rounds, and I used to just fuck, dude. I, re yeah. One hit kills on hardcore. I realize you ask me and then you put it where I tell you to put it <laughs> this whole time. No, I'll if I I just because I agree. Do you agree? Yeah. Docs is a Piccadilly fucking, is literally the garbage just like yeah. worse. I'd rather play nighttime maps. Yeah. Piccadilly. It was fun sometimes on search, but it, I it was we always backed out. You got to put uh, another tart. Wait. I don't know that. Yeah, another ground war map. Gun f the what what map is that called? What? This one? Yeah. I don't remember. Um Says it like it was right one of my favorite ones though. Stack, yes. Stack. Is that one of your favorite Dude, gunfight maps? Stack, Gulag was. Stack like A tier. Yes, it's like one of my favorites. Gulag uh, showers. I don't really care for. That. I always was like, let me get the fuck out of here. I only liked it because if I was sweating, I'd jump left, middle, and right on three v three and just try to get them all. Well, yeah, oh, that yeah. can go below. Put it in fucking. Um, Docs has to go up. Docs has to be up. This there. one, yeah. That has to be up at like A. Is it better than Stack though? I don't know. I don't yeah. think so. I, I don't think, think so. You don't. Fifty fifty. Ready? We're Stack at right next to it. Oh, I was looking. I thought you meant it was better. <laughs> 
I think it's better than a stack. 50-50? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, right, It stays win. where it is. That shit's fucking not as good. I liked it, though. Remember this one? Was that pine or something? Yeah. I didn't one like was, that. That one was, much. like, a little bit more visibility, but it's basically, like, hill. Yeah. Throw it and see. It goes above hill, though. I fucking hate hill. Euphrates Bridge. Remember they took that off so quick? Because it was bad. Why didn't they take hill out? They literally have documents or recorded data of how many people back out and how many times hill was in rotation and no one was, there was no playable lobbies. But they took that map out and I didn't mind it. Yeah, but when you did win on a hill, you felt good about it because you hated it so much. When you win on something you hate, you're like, all right. Yeah, but when oh, this is like the worst gunfight map, and it's like, and it's not even bad. It's just that they're all so good. I like it a lot. All right, well then. I'll but it, it goes below. I'll yeah, put it, I'll put it behind Gunrunner for you. Because <laughs> the other two are way better. Even speed, yeah, speedballs. The we put a fucking gunfight map as S tier so far, so because it's the best. Um. Grosna Raid, Raid was a good map. It's just too big. Yeah, especially when you're... Yeah. Put that at C, right? Yeah. Same with Anaya Palace, but it fucking like... That was... I didn't like that one too much. Yeah, it was definitely playable. And then the last one's from fucking... Uh, fucking Warzone. Delete. I feel that's probably about right. <laughs> it's like gun, yeah, let's, we're just biased to gunfight. <laughs> They're the best maps. So I All these other ones are even... night, cave, and fucking maps that are huge and you can't see on. Yep. You know what? I thought I liked this game a lot, but map-wise, I don't think so. I'd agree. The movement-wise, yeah. Yeah. I even like last year's COD, but the movement was a definitely a little weird. When coming from this, oh yeah, you know, and before at Vanguard and Cold War, Cold War was even pretty weird. I didn't, didn't like Cold War that much. You didn't like it, no, dude. Looking back, I actually think that some of the lobby systems and like the map loading, pause screen, like loading screens, were some of the coolest things. Remember, it had like theme music, and then like a moving picture. Oh yeah, that was cool. The zombies was excellent. We knew it was going to at launch. Remember the night it came out, me, you, and Nick played it? Like That's the first thing we played. We didn't even play multiplayer. Yeah. 1201. Yeah. And we all Isaac, launched right? our PCs. Oh. I like the zombies on Cold War, actually. Yeah. It's yeah. some of the best. Maybe I did like Cold War. What was, I was thinking of... Uh, what was the one they did after that? Vanguard. Vanguard. I that one like. had some pretty cool mechanics, but I don't like World War II. So it's not that I don't like the game. I just don't like the era. Yeah. And I remember playing it a few times with Darren, and it fucks. It is a good game. Yeah. It's not what I want to spend my time playing. Gary liked it a lot. I put like 35, 40 hours into it total. Yeah. I was like, oh, this feels good. It had this mechanic where you could, you know, how you can like mount on something, but it would let you slide on it. If it was a tabletop, you could slide. Oh, yeah. I was like, what? And then there was, you could like destroy shit. So if somebody kept closing and opening a yeah. door, but it was pissing you off. Remember Cold War was like, yeah. Cold War was like, we're going to take the doors out. Yeah. And everybody's like, good. I hate doors. Bring me back that to classic. Annoying. Vanguard was like, hey, there's doors and you can't open them. Bashing, peeking, regular opening. But yeah. if you're tired of looking at it and you could yeah. put, poke holes through it until it bursts like Battlefield. And I was like, I like yo, that. that and slide mount. Let's go. And then MW2 the year later. And then now MW3 took it all out. Yeah. Took it all out. I but Battlefield One was pretty good. Yeah. That's like World the, War Two. That's World War One. One. Yeah, it was one. Yeah, Battlefield Five was World War Two and it was both those games are good. They just I don't know why Battlefield Four was so ahead of its time. Nude, yeah. It played. <laughs> Nude. <laughs> it played so much better. I missed the Battlefield Four. Yeah, I could throw up a Battlefield tier list right now and I would put four S and then I'd be like, I haven't played the other ones. <laughs> really? Even though I have, I just been like they're like not bad company. I haven't played them. I have all the battlefields over here. Hardline was cool though too. Hardline was just four, but cops robbers, and it was pretty cool. I did like Hardline. Everyone shits on it though. A lot. Of I liked do. it a lot. I remember, 
I bought it for Isaac and I for uh, his birthday. I was like, I'm buying a copy, but I got yours because it's your birthday. But we were on different platforms. We weren't even playing together. We just set up in the same room together. And he played on PS3, yeah. and I played on 360, and I was like. Yeah, <laughs> I miss Battlefield. Apparently the new one, or one, or fuck, what's the one called? Five? 2042. 2042? It's really good. But five flopped, At right? launch. No, five was like, yeah, five launched bad, and it stayed bad. 2042 has a nice redemption story. It's got a pretty good concurrent player list now on, like, all platforms. If you haven't played it, you should. No, I haven't. I Because I heard it was just not good. Season, but I always see clips of it, and it looks so right fun. Now. It is. It fixed itself around season four, and they're on season six. They just announced seven will be coming out in February. Do you want to play Battlefield? Yes. Ooh. I'd love to try some Battlefield It's cross-platform. Now everything is. Well, it's cross-platform for... PS5, Series X, and PC, but if you're trying to play with anybody on Xbox One or PS4, they shut those guys off. Oh, really? Yeah. Why? It's because... Too many mm-hmm. bugs? Move on. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah, dude. EA is being scummy. Damn. It's whatever. People are so acting so weird about last gen. They're all like, it just turned 10. Why is the newest Call of Duty or any game for that fact coming out for this thing? And I'm like... Xbox 360 came out in 2005, and Black Ops 3 in 2015 came out for it. Why are we acting like it's anything new? Now... And Forza. Yeah, and then... But I will say, though, if... If the next COD in 2024, October, november comes out for PS4, that'll be the first year ever... Ever... Or that'll be the first time in history that it'll, it'll be the 11th copy for a system, yes. Do you think it's crazy that they make a game every year? No, because they don't. I know they copy and paste. There's three developers. I know. So when one releases, it gives the other one. It's a two-year cycle. Yeah, doesn't that Treyarch, seem like quick, though? Treyarch hasn't put a game out since 2020. So this will be the first time Infinity Ward and Sledgehammer did this recent one. So Treyarch's next game will be four years in development. But Isn't that f- funny that they do that, and then you have like Rockstar over here for years and years and years? They're trying to wring out as much money they can with like GTA well, they have, Five. They have or, B teams too, but they just do yeah. really shitty ports of, res, you know, Red Dead Redemption on PS4 and not doing one for Series X because technically they don't have to because of the backwards compatibility program. Yeah, they literally only reported the new, uh, the old game over to PlayStation Four because you can put a 360 game in a series. I remember that didn't last long. People were like, oh, you can play PS3 games on PS4 now. And people, a, mo- a lot of the games were having issues. Or uh, n- no PS3 games are backwards compatible on any system. Are it really? 360 t- can, though, forward on Xbox, Xbox One and Series X. Maybe that's what I was thinking. Yeah. Of. Yeah. Kind of silly. And they didn't, they're like, yeah, you can do it. Just do it. Well, that didn't happen right away. You couldn't play... No, I know. That didn't happen until fucking Phil Spencer took over Xbox and tried to make it better. And he did. He did do a good job, but he has then, since then, said things and won't do anything. Still a cool guy, though. (laughs) I, I bought that Series X, and I have three games for it. That's how many games they put out. It looks nice. It does. <laughs> it looks real good. It's way smaller than I thought it was when it first came out. Everyone's making those mini fridge memes. Yeah. I was like, dude, that that boy's going to be big. That is in- incredible compared to even that. Even the OG Xbox not that big. I mean, yeah, she's chubby, but. For like an OG. Because look at the one. Yeah, that, that one got nicknamed the VCR. Really? Yeah, because I like it. The that's the original. Yeah, do you notice those are like muscle cars, and then Playstations are like sports cars. They're like aerodynamic, and then Xbox is like fox bodied. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're all square bodies, and <sighs> I like the both. But and then until the 360 came out, I guess look because then PlayStation and PlayStation Two Emotion Engine. Those were boxy. The same buzzwords. They're like, we just got to switch it up. <laughs> yeah. Dual shock. 
Sony. Yeah. Spider Dude 3. Spider Mine. Damn, dude. Yeah. yeah. You should get a PS5, dude. I was thinking about it. Nah. I know a kid down the road that was mean to me, so maybe I'll pay him a visit. <laughs> Give myself a Christmas present. Wait. Shit in his stocking. Steal his PS5? Dude, I hate kids in my fucking neighborhood. I hate kids. Yeah. I hate. I. <laughs> you hate kids? Dude. Yeah, like nowadays, they have yeah. no respect for... I sound like an old fuck, dude. <laughs> yeah. No, not even oh, that. Good. It's fine. I didn't have, I've done crazy shit. I've checked a few door handles in my life, but... Um, the, it's ridiculous. And then my, just watching my nephew grow up, just glued to his iPad. I got an iPad kid in my house. He, wa- it's kind of embarrassing because him and I watch similar videos sometimes. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> yeah. What are you watching? <laughs> and I like hear it from his bedroom. I'm like, oh, I've seen this one. <laughs> oh, I've it's seen so this awkward. One. Yeah. Like, dude, fucking 10 years apart. <laughs> it's just kind of awkward. But, yeah, that's pretty nice. I'm yeah. starting to... I feel myself getting older. Like, and mentally and emotionally. I always thought oh, I was yeah. a little bit older than what I, than most people my age, but, like, mentally. Mm-hmm. Like, just because of what I cared about and how I thought about things. But now I'm becoming, like, a boomer, dude. Yeah, and I hate that holidays aren't don't feel the same. I know. I don't. I, I try forgot to get last year that it was Christmas. Oh, like I was. I usually get super excited within that first week and just feels nice and whatever. But lately, it's just like, yeah, stressed. These past two years, money and fucking time and fucking I know effort and I have to do shit. And if you don't get good sleep, the things you thought you were looking forward to can totally just like dismantle itself. Oh yeah, I don't. I need. Yeah, I. I think the one thing that could be a contributor to that is, so I was so used to just having no worries, and I'm like, dude, I get a few days off, and I can just play games with everybody. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like, remember winter break. I remember, I miss COVID. Dude, I'll get Christmas, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I worked through COVID, so I didn't really get to. I did too. For I had a month off, though. I had a month off or something. Right when it happened, because everyone was like, I don't know what this is. <laughs> what about I don't winter know break? what it does. Uh, just winter break back in, like, the days, dude. Like, early high school, late middle school. We, you know, we were all Christmas noobs to COD. And we'd have, like, the rest of the fucking... Like next two weeks off, we would just sit and play our new games online. Yes, people would call our Xbox school. Live. Yeah, you have you called off work just recently for fucking <laughs> for a game release, didn't you? I had PTO. I didn't just like call <laughs> in. Imagine you had PTO for school. I did call in for a game though. I have before where it wasn't scheduled because two people. Oh, they fucking know about it, too. They mentioned it to me. Like, we know what you did, and don't let that shit ever happen again. And I was like, okay. Don't let it happen again. Well, no, because Fuck what you. it was is um, t- there's only there was only five of us in my department, and two of only them five. asked. Huh? There's only five. They're actually five. And <laughs> two of them had asked to take the day off, Tyler and Austin, for the same game. They're like, hey, something's happening tomorrow. We need the day off. But they were like, all right, that's 40% of the department. Nobody else can go. So I was like... Well, I was thinking about putting mine in, and then Austin was like, well, if you put yours in, then they're not going to approve mine, so I'm just not going to do it. Just you go ahead. I'm like, no, that makes me mad. You've been a longer fan. You do it. I just won't go. What and game like, was it? Elden Ring. Oh, of course. And I look at Kyler, and I was like, and he's like, <laughs> so I, I told Austin, I was like, yeah, I guess I'll just work that day, you know, because they won't approve all three of us out of the five. So, you know, they took the day off, and what I do? I just called in. <laughs> Fuck that the next place, day. though, dude. You know, I was like, no, I, a game is coming out and I want to play. That was at mid? No, that was oh. two years ago. That was a year and ten months ago. Yeah, you've been Elden Ring is about to be two years old in two yeah, months. Holy shit. I've been there for four years. Yeah. I was going to say that other place? Fuck that place, dude. Oh, fuck that place. No, holy my current. Shit. No, no, you guys are cool. 
Fucking <laughs> <laughs> thanks. No, you're the old place. Yeah. The old department is who I screwed over though. So whatever. It was Elden fucking ring, bro. <laughs> yeah. Are you dude, serious? It was game of the month. Game of the year, dude. <laughs> Yeah, I had it on PC. I got about 30 hours into it with Kyler, and then uh, I reached a point in the game where my PC would literally crash. Mine so was, it was, it was mine either, getting buggy. It was either restart a build, because every time I'd load in to try to, like, even hurry up and just, like, travel and get away from that, as soon as I'd load in, it would drop to, like, six frames and then white screen. Yeah, my I'm like, what shit the was, fuck? Mine never did that, but it was frame drops like a motherfucker. Mm. It was pissing me off. I remember I got, or Nicole got it for Xbox, and we would play side by side, kind of like you and Isaac did. Yeah. Because it wasn't cross play. Yeah. And then, uh, like, very shortly after, she got her PC. And then she had to restart, but whatever. Yeah. We got to play together. Yeah, I booted that save up. It was right where it left off two years later because I- Steam Cloud saves. And I was like, hey, the Steam Deck's not crashing. And then, like, a couple minutes in, the game fucking freaks out. And I'm like, seriously? Yes, dude. I'm fucking cursed. <laughs> anything PC, Steam related. That's a console, bro. I don't want anything to do with it. That's just hardware with a screen on it. Anything, yeah. Anything. A console schmanchel. Well, <laughs> I'm thinking about, I was thinking about playing that again and going back to Cyberpunk. Yeah. I remember when Cyber, that was one game that I was super excited. I, dude, it was so weird because some people would have bugs. I had zero bug. I never had a bug in that game. I don't know why it always played smoothly, but this is when everyone was complaining about how sh- fucked up it was. And they're like, we fixed it. Well, graphical issues are different from like bugs. Were they having <laughs> bugs or like just people fucking flailing and doing yeah. weird shit? You they didn't have that. any of that? No, hmm. no. And I could play it on RTX with the RTX on huh. at 60 frames, obviously, but it looked really good. I never did. So I was like, I don't know what everyone's talking about. And then I had a buddy who played it. He streamed it. And, like, there was a guy fucking just, like, their cars, like, just moving and twitching and people and yeah. shit was all. But I never had a problem. I don't know why. But I was thinking yeah. about getting back into that. I've never I'm played it. I'm looking at it right now. And you're but, like, yeah, it's a, I got it on a really good <laughs> I've never played it. I've never played it. I bought it because it was on a really good deal. And then I found out right when I bought it that. Hannah's aunt had I brought it home and Hannah's like, What is that? No. And then she had to call her aunt, was like, Andrew got one of those fucking games I gave you a list of. And she was like, Well, what do I what do we do? I'm like, I was like, tell her to take hers back. She probably paid full price. Uh, she's like, Yeah, I bought mine on Amazon. I was confused. <laughs> it was she, she's like, I paid forty nine ninety nine. I'm like, I got a used copy with everything in it. For like seventeen dollars with a coupon. Oh damn. So I was like, Yeah. But you never back. played it? No, I bought it because it was on on sale. This was last Christmas, about a year ago from now. I bought that, and I I just never got to it yet. I just do that. I buy games, and I, they're, it's on my backlog. You'll like it, especially if it's not. I've seen PS, I've seen gameplay. PS Five. Like well, it's a PS Four copy because they they didn't make physical PS Fives copies when it launched. It's and, fun, but when you put it in, it upgrades to PS Five. It shows like the badge, and it it's got all the PS Five specs. Hmm. But yeah, I enjoyed it. I never finished it though. Yeah, I have to. Yeah, my buddy platinumed it. He platinums like every game he touches. Why? Hmm? Why? Why? Completionist. He likes to complete things. Why didn't he complete college? But that's what his mom thinks. He did. Why didn't he complete college? I know, it was a joke. Oh. At least I think he did. <laughs> but he works where I work. So I was making fun of a Mike Walsh. <laughs> this is what I was thinking of. Oh. A little bit of Mickle Walsh. That Resistance game, I remember when that first came out. It was really fun. Fall of Man. Oh, yeah, 2007, bro. A lot of people didn't like that or game either, but from how I remember it, because I was seven or eight. I Fall funny. of Man. Yeah, Resistance Fall of Man. How do you know when that came out? It's a launch title for PS3. Came out the day the console came out. Okay, nerd. But it was really good. It was cool because I've never seen a game like that. Look that it up, I dare you. What? Look it up. It's um, November's. Do we have to do another trivia? No, it's November 18th or 17th. One of those two. November 17th, 2006 is when Resistance Fall of Man came out. 
I get the day wrong, but I know it's November of 06. <laughs> I was trying to listen to you and type at the same time. I said, when did resistance fall of man? <laughs> 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 and it then it said... November? Uh-huh. 18th? No. 17th? No. 16th? No. What year? 2006. 11th. November 11th? Oh, Resistance 3 came out September 6th. That was a good one. Yeah. That one had move compatibility. 2011. Oh, what about the Resistance 2? I couldn't tell you. Oh, 09? What? It, oh, 2008. Hmm. Very close. Very close. What time are we at, mate? I'm going to guess about uh, 55 you minutes. You can't look at it and then guess. No, because I can't see it. I'm looking at the time. I know we actually officially started at like 8 o'clock. It's like 8.53. Oh. <laughs> he can boo, motherfucker. <laughs> well, we can wrap it up here if you'd like. I would like. I'm tired. I got to get some good sleep tonight. If, I, if we could, like, tier list all of our episodes. That'd be cool. The tier list podcast. Yeah, but, like, I'm just saying, like, this episode, I apologize. It's a little, a little quiet night. The calm before the storm. That is Christmas. Yeah, dude. I'm just pooped. Yeah, man. We're going to yep. start having to do this on the weekends or something. Yep. Right before, like, a band practice or something. A fan practice. We got to come up with a new band title name. Tell us in the comments what we should fame the NAND. Yeah, because some assholes with the 1,100 followers. We could literally just push them out of the way. I guarantee it. Our dicks? Yeah, dude. Get out of the way. <laughs> Did you listen to that song that he sent? No. Of them? Is it good? I listened to part of it. Oh, I think I did click it, actually, yeah. Yeah, it was all right. I listened to part of it, though. Yeah. How ironic. Yeah. So, Elden Ring is the new name of our band. <laughs> Old Jewelry. <laughs> The tier listers. <laughs> the leer testers. The leer sisters. The lyrical laughter band. <laughs> <laughs> what if we just name it a chronicle? A spell with like an E, like effect and effect. E chronicle. <laughs> e chronic, motherfucker. <laughs> Mm. All right, let's crip walk on out of here, homie. Chef's kiss. Thank you for watching today's yes. podcast. And now we shall cue the outro. Like and subscribe. I know.